you ever fear writing a boring story? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Uh, um, I, oh, no. I, I, uh, it, it, do you mean fear? Ha, define fear? Define fear right. for me. Well, I, th I think, I think for some people, you know, it sounds like you're okay with not being perfect. But I think for some people, that's their whole sort of persona. Maybe they've been told it all their life. Maybe that it's a class thing or, I, I mean, yeah. but that's their element. That's who they are. They, they live in that world that I do everything right. So then they don't want to do stuff that's wrong. But it sounds like if you're willing to be free and make mistakes, then boring doesn't really enter the picture. I, n yes, and, 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 and that's it. I'm not afraid of being boring because I, I just, the, the, I, I'm, I will s jump off creative cliffs and, I, and, and sometimes I'll land really hard and break my neck. Uh, and sometimes I'll, 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 I'll land exactly where I need to land. But boring isn't an issue for me. And it's, and it's interesting because I've been at this a long time now and I feel more unboring than ever. I feel, I, I feel creatively unleashed. Some of it is I have nothing to prove. I've got some cool posters and a couple of classics and all of that. Uh, but I'm, I'm, not, I'm not ever worried about boring. I am worried about good. And that's a different thing. And good that it's going to resonate and, uh, and, and, and that people are going to feel it. And that's a different thing. Not, but not boring, but being good, I worry about every day when I write. And I, I'm, I'm very, I'm, I'm, I'm my hardest, uh, harshest critic. And sometimes that gets in the way a, a little bit. I, I, I wish I could go to bed not analyzing and reanalyzing what I wrote th that day, but maybe that goes with the territory. But yeah, I always want to, I, I want to be better than good. And, and I wasn't, you know, and, and again, it's so, sort of silly and, and maybe arrogant as it sounds and like when I was starting Beetlejuice with Michael, we're going to write a classic. I want everything I do to be great. And you don't always do that. I'm not even pretending that you always do that. But good isn't good enough ever for me and boring doesn't enter into it. So when you see a student, let's say, that you can tell that's maybe something they need to get out of that rigidity, um, what tips do you have for a writer that, or to help them avoid writing a boring story? Because maybe they're too, too perfect, you know? Yeah, and, and, and it's, and, and it's your, um, yeah, what, it, that's so, that's so true. Um, that uh, students, uh, writers, uh, new, I'm going to say new writers, uh, that sense of perfectionism and that sense that they have to get it right the first time. And uh, when, 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 I, when, when I teach, uh, there, there are people within this room who can attest to this fact. <laughs> when I teach, I am the home of TMI. I come in and vomit everything <laughs> going on in my life, uh, be it good, bad, tragic, uh, happy. Uh, I, I, uh, I, am, I am an open book. If I'm being completely honest, A, because it's free therapy and I have a captive <laughs> audience of 20 people. <laughs> but it's also because I, I, I here, here one, one, of, one of the great sages uh, and, and, uh, of all time and, and uh, with a view of the human condition, Jimmy Page from Led Zeppelin <laughs> great reference. said, yeah. uh -huh. said I never want to be respectable. I always want to be responsible. Oh. And I love that quote. And I hope after the first class that people take with me, they know they're not going to get respectable at all. 
uh, I can, I, 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 I will, I will, again, I will tell too much. And there is a little bit of method to my madness though, because, because I don't want, because I know writers, directors who put themselves on that pedestal because they've had this degree of success and they feel that they have to come in and be very buttoned down and very above uh, uh, the, the people that they're talking to or talking down to. I don't look at it like that at all. I, I will tell you about my bad night, my hangover, my whatever. But, but, and, and part of it, again, it's like free therapy, but part of it is also, this is, this is my life and, and, and where, and it's, sometimes it's not terribly respectable, but I'm responsible because I'm responsible because I will get my ass to my computer and write. And don't worry about being perfect. But that is a that, that, that I wish I could say that that my success rate was a hundred percent with that. But again, um, most people will never finish their scripts because that sense of needing to be perfect. Oh, I'm being boring. Oh, this isn't gonna. This isn't working. It will take over and it will crush their creativity. And it's a very sad thing to witness. I try to get people over it. I, I, I try to say, look, it's a first draft. I try, you know, uh, 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 don't worry so much. But, but that is the toughest job any person who's teaching any kind of creativity uh, has, is to convince people to get out of their own way. And my way of doing it, again, is to say, today, students, I am a hot mess. <laughs> but, <laughs> but, those but, are the best but I wrote, they are. but I wrote, but I wrote for four hours. And then they feel okay that they're also imperfect, but whatever sort of front we're all, you know, we all yeah. have our public image that we put out there. I think that's great. Then or if it's really safe. good, well, they feel superior to me. <laughs> well, whatever works. Yeah. Let them, yeah. Let them be yeah. on that, that. Yeah. Yeah. That I mean, yeah. But I mean, but, but again, it's, it, it's some of it's, it's just the nature of my personality, but, but some of it's very deliberate. It just don't, you know, I, 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 I've, you know, I, I've knocked wicker. Uh, I, I've, I've made a living at this for 30 years. I mean, it's insane. Sometimes great, sometimes eh, just skating by, sometimes whatever. But it hasn't come out of being perfect, believe me. But it's coming out of, 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 of having a, a, a enough discipline to write. Always don't need to be respectable. Always be yeah, responsible. Jimmy Page. Jimmy Page. Wow. Thank you. Yeah.